Hello everyone, Sylvan here. So I tried to record uh, me playing the old tree, but apparently I failed miserably at pressing the record button for my commentary. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to basically post comment a little. So let's go. old tree and this is it this is where you start just get a little light I thought there would be more so I waited a few seconds oh. Oop. and here we are in the game Looks like there's little eggs. <laughs> Isn't he cute? He's like a little bug or an alien or something. simple style but so gorgeous I'm not moving this guy by the way he the game moves him for me uh, I just have to figure out when he stops how to progress. <laughs> Click on everything. Oop. Oh, I missed. At first I thought that you had to get the little drop on you, like maybe you would transform or something, but uh, nope, you have to get it on the little uh, flower or whatever that is over there, seed thingy. away the uh, centipede. Bye-bye. And on we go. I don't know what that thing is, but it is creepy. I think it's supposed to be like a little roach or something. <laughs> Beep -beep. There's nothing else you can click now, even though I'm going to try anyway. <laughs> the little bug keeps turning the lights on and off for you. Well, he turns it back on when you turn it off. I don't think anything happens if the lights are on and you press the button.
Nope, can't click on that yet. Obviously, I know what I have to do, but not quite right the first time. And I thought the doors would open or something, and nothing happened, and... Ta-da! I mean, it's like, why is there an elevator, a bug hotel? I mean, where the heck is this supposed to be? It's called an, the old tree, so I would have thought it was inside a tree, but maybe this is supposed to be like bug technology, which is kind of freaking scary because I, I don't want my insects to be building homes literally. And if they have elevators and electricity, they are quite advanced. Clearly this little guy didn't build all this because it was here for him to see, but maybe uh, those that hatched before him did. Who knows? I thought I heard something once, but nothing happened, so it's time to click everything. <laughs> Those two little green dots are seemingly the only two things you can click that do anything. This game is a little bit tricksy sometimes. <laughs> I wanted to make sure I could hear anything that was happening, so I had to turn up the volume a little. Nothing is happening. Can't do anything to the fly. Can't do anything to electricity. It doesn't seem to be anything else. Uh, yeah. Clever little game. obvious this one. Yep. And on we go. <laughs> I like that he can crawl on the ceiling and then he flips over like a cat. Now this is just bizarre. I don't know what's up with this little robot cook. If we are in a bug hotel, I suppose this could be how they get the food to the bugs. But he doesn't, or it doesn't, appear to be able to do anything on its own, so... I don't know, it's weird. And the music got creepy. I'm not sure what this first little vegetable is supposed to be. It's kind of weird. But into the 
Let's see if it goes. And again, now we have a carrot. Kill the fly. Sausage. So we at least have veggies and protein. Well, I hope who's ever getting that soup is gonna like it, because it's not gonna be me eating it. And not this little guy either. closet leads to Narnia even in this game I know it was a, a wardrobe in the Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe and here we go water puzzles why are water puzzles always the hardest puzzles of a game is it just because they have a 3D element where in addition to left and right it's up and down a while to find the answer because I had completely forgotten about the opening scene where you open the door and he crawls through. I just have water. Get the water going, but if you don't figure out what it is, nothing happens. right thing. Of course, the very last thing you try, or you get lucky and hit the right thing, and poof, the answer becomes obvious, right? It's that middle part where you are clicking in exasperation and confusion. Trying everything imaginable. So I thought maybe I could stop the water at a certain level. So I'm like, oh, can I stop it? No, uh, nope, nope, nothing works. Can't do anything unless it's either completely empty or completely full. Not work. It's 
stop it, you can't pull it out, nothing. guy what is stopping you from going I don't understand are you hydrophobic what's the deal yeah there's just a door it had to be empty. The chamber had to be empty. Yep. But, not quite. Something's still wrong. Close that. Nope. Put that in. Nope. One more. Bingo! There he goes. Go! Spiderweb. Poke it, just like everything else in this game. Oh, eyes. It's so creepy. Uh, I don't like this. Honestly, not at all sure what this thing is supposed to be, other than there's an air pump. And of all things, I thought it was going to be a spider, and it's a cat. And I think this whole time it was supposed to look like we were in a sewer, and for some reason, that never occurred to me. And isn't this pretty? I'm not sure why Saturn is lazily drifting by, but it's very pretty. This whole game is very artfully done. The lighting is good, the atmosphere is just right. Some of the visual things like with the, the door that I couldn't see and the little panel, you know, uh, it wasn't obvious to me, but maybe I'm just a little slow sometimes and too used to things being shiny when you're supposed to click on them. And that's it. Really short, sweet, very nice. I really enjoyed it. I hope you did too. Take it easy and don't forget to smile. Remember to smile. That's it. That's what I wanted to say. Take it easy and remember to smile. <laughs> See you guys soon.